to wear recently but some of them are new some of them are not so we're just gonna do a clothing haul to see what happens um yeah so i'm so excited i haven't done this in a while um first outfit let's get started you might see bronco in some of this he's just really sleepy but he's sitting right here if you can see him a little bit bronco do you want to say hi to the camera do you want to say hi to the camera do you want to say hi to the camera he's very sleepy this is bronco everyone Say hi, Bronco. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Let me put him down. But he's sitting there with me, so nipple is out. Okay, first outfit. Brandy top, goldie jeans. I've had these in goldie jeans since sophomore year of college, so like 2019. And then this brandy top, I just got like a month ago. But I like to wear it with just this. I need my shoes. And then my new Jeffrey Campbell boots. They're a little dirty if you probably can't tell. But I got these about a month ago and I've been wearing them everywhere. And I don't know why I haven't gotten a pair of boots like these sooner. I had a pair from Depop, okay, before I got these. And they were only like $30. I don't remember the brand, but I bought them off Depop and I was like, oh, but like that's a steal. Obviously, there's a reason why they were $30. Um, it's okay. They, the whole sole of the foot came apart. Are you okay? Came apart. And um, I had to buy new ones. So I invested in a, like a nicer pair because I know that I will be wearing them everywhere, especially like to the clubs and bars, which I probably shouldn't and I'm falling over. But I love, okay, my jeans are actually like tighter than they usually are. I'm going to show you Hawaii. I'm telling her now. So, boots. Okay, we're going to need like more of like... You know what I could have done? Let me back up. Okay, do you see the boots? Do you see what I, like, what I mean? Really cute, this outfit. Okay, and then... This jacket is to die for. I have no idea where it's from, but it's my mom's from the 80s or 90s, maybe even 2000s, because she wore it. Oh, it's her picture now. She wore it when I was like three or four. So, she's had this for a while, so I can't really tell you guys where I got it, but this is an outfit I've been wearing lately. Let me show you what the shoes, if you can see it, because I don't know if you can. Yeah. Also been wearing this with a black turtleneck mini dress and some tights. And that's really cute with my hair stuck back in a bun. I'm gonna get my sunglasses so we can complete this fit, okay? BRB. Okay, got my sunglasses, they're the specs, and I got them from Anthropology. I think they look really cute with this outfit. Right, second outfit you guys might have seen in my New York City vlog. And I got a button. Okay. Wait, there's one more button. Do we really need a button it though? I feel like we don't need to right now. Okay, so I got this from a thrift store in Dallas. I can't remember the thrift store's name, but it was really cute. I'm gonna figure it out and like put it here because it's one of my favorite thrift stores in Dallas. So I usually wear it with these boots or I have been wearing them with my Jeffrey Campbell platform heels. They're really cute with that, but I'm just loving the boots more. But I also like to wear this. Okay, the lighting's way better here. 
way better. But like I hate the background. I've been wearing this with like a slick bun, but I'm kind of liking it down. But I feel like when you wear it with the bun, you can see all the detail. So really cute. Just like one of my favorite pieces I found too. Look. So this dress, you guys have probably, okay, I'm really fighting the lighting here. This dress you guys have probably already seen in some of my vlogs, I just like can't remember. But lately, I've been wearing it with this, but it's just cold outside, I throw on my jacket. This dress is also from Depop. Um, I think the brand, it's like a vintage Sarah Beth nightgown. But, it's really cute with this other jacket. And I really hope you guys cannot see my underwear because usually I wear it with nude underwear, white lace underwear, or no underwear at all. I hope you guys can see my shoes. I feel like you can. Okay, this outfit, yeah, I'm really obsessed with this one. And even though this is from Depop, I'm sure you guys can find just like a silk spaghetti strap or even like a strapless like little slip, maxi slip, and then just put on another jacket. And this other jacket is the one I've had for like a while from Zara. It's my favorite, good price, good material. Love. I'm definitely gonna be wearing this a lot until it's like extremely freezing, which it doesn't really get in Texas. Sometimes it does, you never know. But, um, there's people here, I'm scared. Um, it's so cute! In the back, so cute. It comes with a matching robe, but like it's really big. And I feel like I don't really need to show you guys because I never like really wear it. So, we love her, we love Slay. Okay, it just got really dark. Um, so this outfit I need to fix up. I literally just got this in the mail today from Depop. No idea what the brand is. I know guys, I don't know a lot of the brands because I do buy a lot of my stuff from Depop. But yeah. Okay, I don't know if I'm doing this right. I'm sure I'm gonna have to like play with it. Yeah, I don't love the way I tied that, but Look how cute it is. So if you don't know, I'm obsessed with sheer clothing. I usually wouldn't wear a bra with this, but for the sake of this video I am. And if it was just a little bit tighter, because I thought it was gonna be a little tighter, I think it'd be cuter with no bra, but since it's a little loose, I think it is cute with the bra. And I think I'd wear a different thong with this. That covered more of my butt. Which is really surprising for me to say. But since it's winter, I think I'm gonna cover up a little bit of the butt more. I don't know. We're still gonna play with this outfit. But I think it's really cute with my boots, which I, again, been wearing these boots with like almost all my outfits. Um, I probably I'm wearing this like on the right side. If not, sue me. But it's so cute. Let's see it from this angle. I just feel like the nude looks really good with my brown hair. It's upstairs. I'll go get it. Okay, it's like literally dark in here. And I don't think the lamps are gonna make it any better. But we might have to resort to that. Okay. Gosh, I'm out of breath. I'm running up and down stairs. So here's it with the jacket. Cute. Obviously, I like it without, maybe. And then said it's cold. Okay, this dress is my absolute favorite dress in the entire world and I will never get rid of it. It's probably my best purchase from Depop and no idea what the brand is. I'm so sorry, I know I don't know a lot of the brands because again, they're either vintage or from Depop, but I know there's a similar one from Mirror Play. And usually I don't wear underwear with this, so if you can see my black underwear, sorry. Don't really feel like taking that off right now. But I'm just obsessed with this dress. It's really cute with the boots. 
or just simple black heels or platform heels. Um, just fits my body perfectly. The only thing I changed about it was the strings touch the floor because you can either leave it open or tight. But I um, altered the strings and had them cut off. But they're still a little long. Um, again, really cute with the leather jacket, but I like to wear it over the shoulders instead of, you know. Um, really love the way this makes my body look. It could be a little dirty because I think I got makeup on it when I was putting this on just now. But I love this outfit. Let's try it in this lighting because again, the sun's literally going down. We also might have to do a part two. Because I have a lot of clothes to show you guys. Slide. I'm also really pale. I'm a pale girl. Let's do a little walk. Slay, slay, slay. And then if you want to get like really creative, you know like at the club, the bar, whatever you want to wear this to, the grocery store, you should do this. Someone gets in your way. It's really simple. Good self-defense tactic. Just whack them. If someone's talking to you, you don't really want to talk to them. Out of my face, out of my way. Someone's beating you up to the floor and kicking you, get them with these. You know, choke them. I don't know. I'm not saying you should, I'm saying that if you are in the situation, bam. You know, that's all you need. All you need, girl. The back is really pretty. Okay, I should probably take this off so I can show you guys everything else because it's gonna get dark. So you guys are literally gonna die. Excuse my nipples. Actually, no, we are not excusing her. Look at this shirt. It says, mother, and then, can you see it? Can you see it? Isn't that so cute? This, also from Depop, but it's an IMG at top. And it is the softest material. Fits perfect, I think it's an extra small. I love it, and I love wearing it with my blue jeans too, but I thought this was cuter. Boots, same thing. And with jackets, really cute too. Oh my gosh, my nose is burning. Actually, I think I like it like this. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, slay. I had like something else to comment about this and I can't remember. But she's cute. Um, I would next time wear this with my hair up so you can see the this part. Bad word. Cause I wore this, no one questioned it, but I know they were thinking it. I wore this with my hair down just like this. Literally just this outfit. And all they read was mother. So they're probably like, oh my gosh, she's like a mom. No. Or they could have thought, oh, like, cute, like, mother, like, I don't know, but I think next time I'm gonna wear the hair up so they can see the battle word. Um, this is my favorite, favorite shirt ever, love it. Okay, hi. We are definitely doing a part two because I have way too many things to show you guys and it's gonna be dark in the next probably like 10 minutes. So, this top is from Depop, I know. I don't know the brand, but I can link the seller because they have more colors in this and they have more of these. So, that's exciting. Um, I think I'm gonna wear this for Thanksgiving or Christmas. It's definitely giving Christmas vibes, but I don't really have anything for Thanksgiving. I'm sure you're gonna just have my look. But I think this would be really cute for Christmas, especially with some tights, because again, it's cold. I'm like really trying to rush. So, it won't be dark. And I can show you more outfits. And you can see the Bronco. Bronco, I love you so much. I don't know, have you guys met Bronco? You guys have definitely met Coconut, R.A.P. Um, he was my old boss in high school, but now we have YouTube Bronco and YouTube Brother. I love him so much, okay. Really cute, y'all need like a close up, more of a close up of her. Ooh. 
she's red and she's festive. I think this too would be really cute with my hair up. Dun, 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 dun. Little thumbnail moment. Ooh, you know what? It's kind of giving me American Girl Love vibes. Like Samantha. I'm probably gonna do two more outfits and I'm gonna rush, okay? I'm gonna rush for you guys. But we can be excited for a part two. Ooh, awesome, look at my nails. Okay, wait, I actually wanna share this because it's really silly of me. I'm really off guard, I mean off topic of what we're, the vibe of this video. Man, I'm really out of breath. But, I like need to back up to tell a story. Yesterday, I had a lot of work to get done and I ordered a Starbucks coffee with five shots of espresso. Okay, I didn't know that was bad for you. I didn't know, I'm like, I drink coffee. You know, I drink coffee. But like, I'm not like a, don't talk to me till I have my coffee first kind of girl. But like, I was like, okay, I need to like get things done and I need, I need energy. Um, I literally thought I was gonna die. I told my dad, it's time, take me to the hospital. And he's like, why? And I'm like, I only took five shots of espresso. And he's like, what? He's probably thinking I'm on drugs, but like five shots of espresso? No one told me that was not normal. So that was my mistake yesterday. And I really wanted to share it with you guys because I'm like, I haven't really slept. Really haven't. So just vibes, but don't do that to yourself. Five shots of espresso, crazy, crazy. But it happened and I survived. And this was the worst mistake of my life. So really need to share that with you guys. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this is this is gonna be my last outfit. And there there has to be a part two because I'm definitely gonna add this in here. Because I don't know if I really like it with the black dress. I have this black dress since high school. It's from NAKD Naked. But this jacket, it's from Depop. And it was a steal. I think it was only $60 or $70. Look at it. It is a sleigh. But it's really cute with the boots, yes. But I really don't know if I love it with the black dress. It's giving me kind of Corella Deville vibes. But I trust in this and I know I can make it look even cuter. So give me some time for part two and you're gonna be like, whoa, she like really transformed herself. Maybe I won't, but I really like this jacket and it's really soft. Um, love. I was really excited to show you guys this. And I literally have, I hardly, I literally have a lot of things to show you guys, but I'm just like running out of time and daylight and I'm really not loving my lips today. But I need to film my outro. Please also, guys, it got really dark. Now I'm gonna film the outro. I have not filmed, it's been a while. Well, it's been a while since I filmed an outro for like a living hall. It's usually just a vlog and I'm like, okay, bye. So I think, what did I used to say? I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, seriously though, let me know what y'all thought of this because I'm gonna obviously do more because you guys wanted me to do these and I miss doing these. I just like haven't, I just like, I think I've just been stuck on vlogging, but I'm still definitely gonna vlog. Um, I'm vlogging this week, filmed last week. We're gonna put it all together, Thanksgiving, whatever I did last week and, and we're gonna do another part two clothing haul really soon, don't worry. And you know what, I've kept my word. I've been posting more, so literally a slay. Um, that's just my favorite word I've been saying lately. So, peace out, Girl Scout.